All right, guys. Today we're out here at Central Pines. We're at Hole Nine Beginner. It's a 185 foot hole. Uh, has a lot of water on this hole, but it's not that long of a that particularly long of a shot. You got water right to the left here, and the basket is up on the hill, pretty much straight ahead. I'm pretty sure y'all can get a view of that. So today we're out here, it is the week between Christmas and New Year, so it's the end of December. We're going to attempt to dive into the lake today. Um, I actually was goofing off on this hole the other day and tried to throw a turnover shot out over the water and it unfortunately did not turn over and came crashing down probably a good 50 feet out. Uh, considering it's December, I don't know if I'm going to be able to even get to it just because I expect the water to be probably around 50 to 55 degrees this time of year. Uh, but we're going to give it a shot. Um, we're going to get out there and dive in. Uh, I don't have a wetsuit or anything. Uh, unfortunately, I'm a big guy, so wetsuits aren't super flattering. So we're going snorkel mask. Um, Along with shorts and a t-shirt, we're going to stay in there as long as we can. Usually this time of year it's 15-20 minutes. And see if we can find anything. Hopefully find mine. If not, maybe get lucky and find someone else's while we're in there. But guys, without further ado, let's...
All right, guys, so we just got out of the lake. Um, unfortunately, this is a church property. It's private property. Um, and while I've talked to the some of the people who work out here, and they're aware, because there's two or three of us locally who go into the lakes and find discs, uh, I always stay very safe about it. Most of the time, we are above water. Uh, very rarely do we actually get into anything more than six or seven feet deep uh but someone from the church did come over and request very kindly that um we stay out of the lake because it's technically church policy so we jumped on out uh we do have quite a few discs today uh more than i expected we find i uh, did not find mine unfortunately uh had a few i think we've got like four that kind of got donated over to the pile via people who just found them out on the course so we'll get those messages out as well, but for what we got today, we have a VIP sword. We have a Factory Second Innova Disc. I do not know, it does have a number, so we'll get that a phone call real quick. A Prime Witness, or, yeah, that is a Witness. A DX AVR. A Prodigy F3, a Prime Escape, got a lot of Prime out here today, Prime Escape, another one. We've got a Pro Turn, don't see a lot of Pro Plastic much anymore, but we found one today. And the two nicer ones of the day, we have... A MVP Proton Vector, which is actually an outer production disc, so I'm sure that person will be very happy to be getting that one back. And most interesting is a first run Prodigy. Uh, I'm not going to announce the model as I have a feeling it could be one of about three locals because they never put their name on disc. Yes, I'm calling you out if you're watching this. Um, but so overall, pretty solid pile of discs. I think we ended up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten discs if we're counting today. Uh, like I said, four of them kind of got tossed this way, but we did manage to find six out of the lake, so pretty good day overall. And with that being said, guys, that's going to be the end of this video. I was going to do the other side of the lake, but unfortunately, like I said, with the church kind of requesting that we stay out, uh, we're going to go ahead and get out of the lake, um, and I will reconfirm availability to get in this lake with um, other uh, church uh, people within the church uh, that being said guys thanks for watching uh, check out the link um, get our affiliate link with uh, Rogue Iron uh, I've done a review of their uh, disc retriever recently for shorter not out as far in the water uh, discs uh, check that out as well they're real good to us um, basically 10% of anything that gets purchased through our affiliate link uh, comes to our account and we use that to buy new discs, new bags, uh, tournament sponsorships, whatever it may be, whatever the local disc golf community needs just to keep it funded. But anyway guys, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Have a good one.